What's up, man? Where are you coming from? Where do you stay? Stop right now. Where are you? Stop. Delta Central. I got a jump, man. I'm running. Better stop right now. All right, Delta 16 has right lost him near the uh, clubhouse. Blue flannel, like sweatpants, uh, blue sweater, glasses, short black hair. White male, probably 120 pounds, okay? Um, about 5'8". You can see a little spot back there. Sheriff's office announced itself now. Or you'll be bit. <clears throat> Sheriff's office. He said straight ahead of you. There's a helmet or something right there. See it? A uh, person laying down. Get up. Get up now. A uh, shoe. Get up. Now, show me your fucking hands. Right now. Get out. Come on. Let's go. Put your hands behind your back. Be secured. Because you know what you did. We know what you did. That's why we're here. I thought there's a canine here. I thought a helicopter was here. That's why there's about, what, you say 15 or 20 deputies that were here? There's a reason for that. Why is that? Okay. Yes, that's why. That's weird, man. It, puts pe it makes people uneasy and puts people, at, you know, like, it puts a weird feeling in your gut when you find out someone's looking at you through a window. There, you look like this, outside of a window, peeking through it, and the neighbor says, hey! And you're like, oh, shit. You take off? Don't ring a bell in your head? Okay. What would you do if some man was peeping at your at your wife through a window? I wouldn't be happy. You know, you wouldn't go whoop his ass, right? You know? He said we can just drive over to the district. All right. All right. Get my phone. I got your phone. Just in the phone. All right. We'll get you in some warmth, and uh, I don't know if we have any dry clothes. Come have a conversation with you. Make sure you're okay. No, I'm not, I'm not doing this in front of nobody. I'm not doing nothing right here. I'm Why not? Yeah. All I need to do is check your well-being and make sure that you're okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know if you know what it's like to actually be. Said so he's not leaving his spot. He he was he was in the woods. He walked to his car to charge his phone, but he's unwilling to meet because he doesn't want to be Baker active because he feels that. Uh, going, yeah, being put away like that is going to just cause... Call the kangaroo and have them lock up the store, please. He's walking out towards the cars. He's right by the dumpster. 60, do you want us to challenge him? Uh, that's that's going to have to be your decision there. Just use caution. He's He's probably got that signal zero on him. 
keep in mind, we have no criminal charges on this guy. It's just a Baker Act. This is Joel. Can you hear me? I can, uh, I can hear you. So I'm just gonna go ahead and talk. I'm here at the, uh, the gas station. Uh, I'm with the sheriff's office and uh, I'm here to, to, to try to talk to you and uh, see what I can do for you to, uh, to resolve this. So I understand you've been talking to, to some other people for a while now. Um, I'm right here, so I, uh, nobody's been hurt. You're not hurt, nobody out here is hurt. You're not in any trouble. So let's, uh, let's try to work through this together and, um, and just come up with a resolution to this that works for you and, and for us here. We've, 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 we've already, we've already talked about that. I, I, I agree with you. I don't, I don't know the situation you're in, and I won't pretend to know the situation you're in. But man, man to man, the one thing that you have that that makes you have to continue on to the next day are those two lives that you uh, you brought in this world. No matter how bad it is for you, you owe it to them. said we've been talking for a little while and we've talked about a lot of reasons a lot of reasons that uh, you're not done a lot of reasons why you you have a lot of things to continue on for so put that gun away and just come out here and let us get the help that uh, that you need I think you want this to to be over peacefully. I think you I know I know you're I know you're hurt, I know you're frustrated, I hear it in every word that you say. I also hear you tell me over and over again that you want to save yourself and I want to help you do that. Put your hands down! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him!
listen, stop fighting. Take a deep breath. Relax. Your We're fighting is only making it worse. Calm down. Uh, You're not going uh, anywhere. The game's uh, over, all right? No, it's not. It, it is. It is. You're uh, done, okay? Stop fighting. Uh, it's only going to get worse if you keep fighting. I'm going to keep fighting. Uh, uh. You're not going to keep fighting. Yeah, I am. Your stomach. No, stop. Let me up. Help. All right, lay, lay down your on your stomach. Lay down on your stomach. Lay down on I your can't. stomach. Right here on this side. Down by the hip. Right here, right here. Please. 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 And if you know, another thing, they were wearing all black clothing. One had long dreads and one had a top knot on their head. I'm at Hamilton and New York. The SUV is directly behind me. I'm going to hold them up right here. I'm right behind you right now. There's more around you. Whoa! Our suspect's in the back of it, guys. He's in the back of it, dreadhead. He's 12F. South Island Hamilton, they're known suspects. I can't tell if he's got a gun pointed at me or not. Right there. Now to you now. Now to you now. Come out the port. South South. WC1. Looks like he had a gun pointed at me at the back window. Air 1, you got him? Dead 4, coming up to Lawton right now. And we are eastbound on Lawton from Hamilton. These are known suspect guys, but it looks like he pointed a gun at me. Uh, going to be your call. He's 
vehicle is eastbound on French. As of right now, pursuit's authorized. Don't go over 80 miles an hour. I need an answer. Did he point a gun at you? It looked like he had a gun, yes. It looked like he pointed a gun at the back window. To the ragged reader, follow the fire on the law enforcement officer. Stick it, stick it. Still northbound, still northbound on 17. Coming up to Minnesota. There they are. There they are. There they are. Coming at you. Right there it is. Right there. Okay. Alright. Still northbound. Get up to Orange Camp. Through the light. Around the car. LA2 and LA4 are patched. I know the suspect vehicle. Go ahead and call back to you. Just stay up front. Let everyone call. Start to call back. 10 3, bail out, bail out at the CVS running towards Starbucks. Through the parking lot. Black male, all black dreads. Get on the ground! You're gonna get shot! You're gonna get shot! Don't move! Don't move! Where's the other one? We got one or something. Where's the other one? Delta 24, we got one in custody.
Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I got the machete, I got the knife. Okay, um, we got the, we got the machete, we got the knife. We just tracked up to his hat, his machete, and his baseball bat. Okay. We're 10, 12 boys, and he's not showing us his hands. He's up in a tree. That's what I'm concerned about. Why can't you feel your feet? All right. Well, go ahead and hoist yourself up on your arms. Hoist yourself up on. All right, all right. Get the feeling back in your legs and come on down. I'm good with that. He's gone. He's gone. We got eyes on head northbound. Just turn left, heading back to the uh, LOI, heading back to the house in the cul de sac. Behind the house at the two corner. Behind the house at the two corner, got one male exiting driver's side door, running to the north behind the houses. Right, get, get on me. Yep. All right, I'll try to guys over there. All right, let's click. Okay, so head towards the woods. Somebody head over to Ridgeway or Ridgeview Drive. Looks like a bunch of apartments. Towards Ridgeview Drive. Okay, head to your left. Head to your left. Head towards the woods right there. Go straight in. Where your right arm is now, 10 feet in from where you're in. He's laying down in the bush, not moving. You can probably give commands and he might come out. And you might be able to hear you. Hey, want any movement or not? None that we can see. Still just underneath the tree line. Yeah, it looks like he's trying to crawl away from you guys, further into the woods. Your left now, that's to the north. He's heading towards uh, 129 Pine Valley Court. 129 Pine Valley. He's actually in that backyard right now. Show me your hands. Show me your hands. Somebody light him up. Where are you, man? Speak up. We're in contact. Speak up and walk to me. I'm right here. Right here. Yeah, right here. What are you doing, man? Hands up. Well, I ain't dragging you out. You're way too fucking big for me. Roll over on your belly. Ah, I got him. Come on, get here. up, grab man. That, you grab that arm. Ah, shut up. No, man, I don't All right, do you want the German Shepherd to pull you out, then? No. I could have got it on myself. Obviously not. You want to lay in the fucking ground like a preschool. I fail. And making no fucking effort to get out. Ah, shit. Oh. Roll over. Roll over. On your fucking stomach. Did you really think you were going to get away, man? 
see me in 20 years, man. Yeah. Y'all see me in a week. Yeah, Father of the Year. Go we'll, father, let the, we'll let the judge know you said that, too. Yeah, I know it. Yeah. Tell, hey, put that, put that on your body cam. Spread your feet. Spread your feet. <laughs>